To find the value of y in this equation, we are going to be applying three laws of indices. That is the product law, the quotient law, and the power law. And also, we'll be expressing it in base 2 because most of our base are in base 2. The first thing we'll be doing is to simplify this. To simplify this, we're going to apply the law of indices, which says if we have a raised to the power x times a raised to the power y, this is the same as a raised to the power x plus y. If we apply the same to this, this will become 2 raised to the power 1 minus y plus y minus 1 over 2 raised to the power y plus 2 equal to 8 will be expressed in base 2. 8 in base 2 is 2 raised to the power 3 raised to the power 2 minus 3 y. Now the next thing we'll be doing is to further simplify this. To simplify this, minus y plus y is 0. 1 minus 1 is 0. So this will become 2 raised to the power 0 over 2 raised to the power y plus 2 equal to to simplify this, we are going to be applying the power law, which says if we have a raised to the power m raised to the power n, this can be expressed as a raised to the power m n. This is used to multiply this. If we apply the same to this, this will become 2 raised to the power 3 times 2, which is 6. 3 times minus 3y is minus 9y. Now, to further simplify this, we are going to be applying the quotient law to this. The quotient law says if we have a raised to the power x over a raised to the power y, this is the same as a raised to the power x minus y. If we apply this to this, this will become 2 raised to the power 0 minus y plus 2 equal to 2 raised to the power 6 minus 9y. Now, this will become 2 raised to the power minus y minus 2 equal to 2 raised to the power 6 minus 9 y because minus times y is minus y minus times plus 2 is minus 2 now since we have the same base the powers will also be the same this implies minus y minus 2 will be equal to 6 minus 9 y to find the value of y we'll be collecting like times that is minus y minus 9y will move to this part minus 2 will move to this part so this will become 9y minus y equal to 6 plus 2 9y minus y is 8y equal to 6 plus 2 is 8 the next thing is to divide both sides by 8 if we divide both sides by 8 8 we cancel 8 y will be equal to 